Hello there, I am Giant Girl with my Pokemon Yellow. In the last part, we took on the Cinnabiron Gym, got our 7 Gym Badges, the Volcano Badge. Now we're back here, we flew back to Viridian City, and the Gym Leader has returned to Viridian City. We don't know who he is, or uh, who he or she is, I should say. And then, uh, yeah, I have Brute Root up front, because this is a ground type gym, let's go inside. So let's talk to the Vice Giver first. Uh, yo, champion making, even I don't know Viridian's, Viridian's leader's identity. This will be the toughest of all the gym leaders. I hear that the trainers here look like ground type Pokemon. Interesting. So this is Viridian City Pokemon gym leader, Giovanni. Ooh, Giovanni's the gym leader? What? No, I'm just kidding, I already knew. <laughs> so winning trainer is Sean. Of course Sean beat this gym. Of course he did. So what, I, I just like facing these uh three trainers first. I don't know why, it's just like that would be the easiest to get to in my opinion. I could be wrong on that. <laughs> you must be running out of steam by now. You're yeah, my first trainer, so joke's on you. Let's battle. So, uh, here's a tamer, okay, a cool trainer male, okay, I thought it was a tamer because he had a whip, okay, whatever. Sand slash level 39, cool. Let's go for the, um, I just want to go for the vine whip, honestly. I'm doing it for the vine. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> this sand slash is level 39, like I said before, and I uh, didn't faint it. Yeah, okay, because vi yeah, vine whips is my weakest move power wise, I guess you could say. Yeah, exactly power wise. Because all my Pokemon, all of my moves for Brute Root, or all Brute Root's moves are grass type Pokemon. So, a grass type, grass, the grass type, I should say. Uh, let's go for the Mega Drain to hopefully regain the 4 HP I lost there. Yeah, there we go. Nice full heal. Awesome. Cool. Okay. From now on, I'll just use, I'll use Razor Leaf or something, you know, Doug Trio, cool. We saw Doug Trio and Diglett's hit a couple of times, or maybe at least once, I'm pretty sure. Let's go for the Razor Leaf on this thing. It missed, of course, it's gonna slash on us. That's not good, it's gonna get a quick lit. I did, we still did a less than I expected, but again, it's level 39, but we're still 9 levels higher, but, higher than it, but you know, you never know what could happen. So this Doug Trio is level 39, and it goes down, critical hit, nice. Cool. Do you cool train of mail? Okay, awesome. I ran out of gas. Sorry, thanks for the 1,365 pocket dollars though. Okay, roar. I'm working myself into a rage. Don't do that. You're gonna, you're gonna pass out or something if you get too stressed out or something. I don't know. This is a black belt guy. He has um, a chop though. Nice. Um, let's go for the raise leaf. It hits. Awesome. This my chapter is level 40, so we're still 8 levels higher than it. Nice. We're going to level 49, awesome. I'm a choke, okay. We'll go to... We'll go to Tabasco and actually use Fly, because that's like the one... That's like one of the only moves that I have on my Pokemon that uh, is super effective against fighting type Pokemon, because I don't need psychic type moves, really. Let's go for the Fly. Focus energy, it's gonna try to raise its chance of getting a critical hit. So it's getting pumped, but if I hit, it's awesome. It's level 40, we're 9 levels higher than it, and then when it kills it, awesome. Cool. We defeat a black belt, awesome. Warg, thanks for 1,000 pocket dollars. Here is a uh, tamer, I think, or a juggler, or a, I don't even know. Yeah, sorry, I skipped your dog, I'm sorry. This is a tamer, okay, yeah. He has one Pokemon, it's a Rhyhorn, okay. Cool. So I'm gonna use Mega Drain on it because it's a uh, super four times super effective and it'll it'll heal some of Brute Root's um HP that I lost. It'll recover some of its HP I lost. So yeah, that go and, and it'll restore it all. Cool, nice. Awesome, we defeated Tamer. You are in perfect time, mate. Thanks. Thanks for 1720 pocket dollars too. What there's an item in a gym? Haha. <laughs> We got a revive, awesome. Here's another trainer. Now the truly talented win with style. That's that's somewhat true, but it's not always true, I guess. This isn't the cool trainer male, I guess. He has a he has a right horn. Okay, cool. Let's go for the vine whip and let's see if the one he kills it. It's four times super effective, so you never know. Vine whip attack. It's level forty to be it, so it's six levels higher than it. There we go, it takes it on one hit, awesome. We defeat Cool Trainer Mail. I lost my grip. I'm sorry, man. Thanks for 1,505 Poker Dollars, though. Here's yet another trainer. In the Karate... I'm the Karate King. Your fate rests with me. We'll see about that. Let's battle. Okay, 
Okay, so this is Matrix level 38, nice. Let's go for the Raids Leaf, I guess. It's level 38, we're, we're um, 11 levels higher than this thing, so that's good. Cool, critical, and nice, we took it out. Machop, okay. We'll stay in and use Razor from this Machop too. This, this Machop is level 38, so it level us higher than it too. Just like the Machoke earlier. So it's awesome. Let's see if this one it kills it. It does, awesome. Critical hit, I'll take it. And then one last Pokemon, and then Machoke. Cool. Let's go for the Razor Leaf. There we go, 1 KO, awesome. We defeated Black Belt, awesome. Oh uh, yeah, <laughs> thanks for the 950 pocket dollars. Let's go back this way. Okay, that's a dead end over there, okay. Yeah. I think we can go this way next. These little panels just spin very slowly, which kind of stinks. Here is a Tamer, I believe, if I were to guess. Your Pokemon will cover, will cower at the crack of my whip. You are a Tamer, probably, because of your dialogue. Let's battle, man. Tamer wants to fight. Cool. Sent out Arbok. Okay. Well, uh, I'm going to switch out Pokemon, because all my whole group has this grass type moves, you know, and that's not super effective against Poison type. Let's go to Lavender, then, because Lavender has Earthquake. Which is super fit against poison type moves. It's gonna use bite on us, okay. It's gonna use lavender. It's gonna use bite on us, it's gonna be lavender. Let's go for the earthquake. So our box is level 39, so we're 10 levels higher than it. Let's see here. When it K awesome, it's super effective, awesome. I like it. And then you're about to use Tauros. Let's switch to uh Grumpy and use like Low Kick, because Tauros is a normal type. So it's gonna be super effective then. Yeah. This Taurus is level 39, so we're 10 levels higher than that. Let's just we'll kick on it. I'll kill this Taurus. There we go. When it kills it, awesome. We defeat Tamer. Awesome. Ouch. Whiplash. Thanks for the 1,560 Poké Dollars. Pretty sure that's the amount. Do you have poison type Pokemon or something? You have a. I think this is in the back of so a fighting type Pokemon, honestly. Yeah. Karate is the ultimate form of martial arts. Yeah, I guess that's a fact. It could be an opinion, too. I don't know. I'm not for sure on my knowledge about my shorts. Yeah, it's this black belt has one Pokemon. It's a Machoke. It's level 43. Nice. Let's try Let's try a Solar Beam attack. So, yeah, Solar Beam. Yeah. We were took in Sunlight. And the next turn, I'll use Solar Beam, which is pretty cool. Not very effective. Sorry, man. Solar Beam hits. Awesome. This Machoke is level 43. And we're, um... Six levels higher than it, critical hit, awesome. Nice, we took out one hit. Brute is now level 50, awesome. Nice. Achoo, <laughs> it looks like you were about to sneeze there, your dialogue for there. Looks like you were sneezing or something, I may have mispronounced that word. Thanks for 1,775 pocket dollars. Okay, there's one more turn I'm going to have to fight, and that's the one we just passed right there. So I'm going to put, um... I'll switch with Storm, I guess, and then uh, we'll put Gamma up front, I guess, just in case he has, just in case he has ground type moves, so ground type Pokemon, you know. But yeah, this looks like a, I don't know, looks like a cool trainer male sprite. I don't know. But the gym was closed for a long time, but now our leader is back. That's good to know. Cool trainer wants to fight. Cool. Here do we know? Okay. Okay, so this thing's level 39. Let's go for the strength on this thing, see how much it does. Ooh, it does a little buff. Cool. Double kick, okay. We're 10 levels higher than it, so that's good. And then we're just gonna do 12 HP on a uh, gamma, so that's good. Let's do another strength attack. And it takes out awesome. Gamma, good level 50, awesome. Needle King, okay, let's switch, let's stay in actually. It's Needle King's level 39, let's go for the big bad surfer on it. Nice. Awesome. What do you think, cool trainer mail? Nice. I was beaten? 
Thanks for 1,265 pocket hours. So I think we have to just take on the gym leader now. I don't think we even have to go back to heal because our Pokemon aren't in that bad of shape. Okay, I keep on spraining here. And then we made it to the gym leader basically, yeah. Here's Giovanni. Okay, uh, just making sure I have a game up front. I do, nice, okay. Let's talk to Giovanni. For haha, -ha, so this is my hideout. Uh, I plan to resurrect Team Rocket here, but but you have caught me again. So be it. This time, it's I'm not holding back. Once more, you shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Sure, you used to call yourself the greatest trainer, but what about the Elite Four? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, that's actually true. Here's Giovanni again. He wants to fight. I think he has five Pokemon. It said. So he has uh yeah, Doug Trio's level 50. Jeez. Okay. Let's go for the. Let's go for the strength first. It's gonna use Earthquake on us, of course. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna use Earthquake. That did less than I expected, so that's good. Okay, so it's gonna do a little bit of half. It's gonna put- it's gonna dig a hole. Okay, so I'm gonna take the chance to heal here. Which I need to buy some more healing items, actually. <laughs> it's gonna just dig, okay. Cool. It's gonna be- let's use another strength on this thing. Got it's picked on Duck Trio. Hopefully this still faints it though. Um, it does. Awesome. So I didn't have a water type move yet. <laughs> and I still fainted one of his Pokemon. Nice. Persian. Okay. Let's go to uh, Grumpy for this one. Because Grumpy can use a little kick on this normal type Pokemon, of course. Persian's level 53. Jeez. Okay. Let's go for the little kick on this thing. Little kick hits. Awesome. And it almost when it kills it. He might heal here, but I'm going to go all out with, um... I'm going to probably use, uh... Seismic Toss to finish it off. Yeah, he does. He didn't heal there. I'm surprised. But yeah, this should take it out. Nice. Needle Queen. Okay. So let's switch back to Gamera. This Needle Queen's level 53. Geez. Well, this Pokemon at least level 50 or higher. Well, maybe not all, but so far, I guess. Let's use Safe on this thing. Let's see how much this does. One of kills are awesome, nice. Okay, Needle King, okay, we'll stay with Gamera. Needle King is level 55, wow, okay. So you're safe on this thing. I don't know if it'll one hit KO it, but we can try. Nice. Gamera good level 51, awesome. But he's right on. We'll switch to uh, Brute Root for this one. Right on Sprite looks pretty cool in this game. <laughs> this Right on's also level 55. Let's go for the um, Raise Leaf, I guess. Let's see here, does it faint it in one hit? Let's see. It does. Could call it. I'll take it. So far, it's not too hard. If you have a grass or water type Pokemon that knows like Surf or Raise Leaf or Vine Whip or any of those good water to grass type moves, and if you have a fighting type Pokemon for that Persian, you know, this battle's not too hard. Ha! Huh, that was truly an in 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 intense fight. You have won. That's proof here is the Earth Badge. Uh, we got 5,445 Pokemon dollars for winning. Nice. The Earth Badge makes Pokemon of all any level of bay. It is evidence of your mastery as a Pokemon trainer. With it, you can enter the Pokemon League. Yeah, it, it is my it is my gift for your Pokemon League challenge. Um, we get TM, which is 27, which is Fizzer. Fizzer, it takes out Pokemon with just one hit. I made I made it when I ran the gym heal too like too long ago. Talk to him again. Having lost, I. Cannot face my underlings. Team Rocket is finished forever. I will dedicate my life to the study of Pokemon. Let us meet again someday. Farewell. And he goes away. Yeah. I think in Fire Emblem Green, if you use a, the item finder where he's standing, and you can get like a Macho Brace or something. Not exactly sure, actually. So yeah. Okay. 
Oh, that's just taking a long time to spin around, yeah. Okay. So let's talk to Vice Giver again. Uh, but only wait, Giovanni was the gym leader here? Yes, he was. Okay, video City Pokemon gym leader, Giovanni, winning trainer, Sean, Steven. Cool. So we beat that, yeah. So we use what the badge looks like, actually. We have all the badges. It looks like a torch kind of thing. It's just pretty cool. I don't think it's supposed to be like a torch, but yeah, we have all eight badges now. So our name is Steven, of course, or my name is Steven. Our money right now is 160,265 Poké Dollars. Our, our play time is 102 hours and 20 minutes. So now we have all eight gym badges. We can head for the Pokémon League, which is just east of, uh, or west of Viridian City. So that's where we battled, uh, Sean for the second time in the game. So yeah, we actually have to battle him. We can battle him again, but this time it's mandatory. It's not an optional battle. So, uh, I'll put the TM for Fissure, which is TM27, of course, in the PC. I'm just gonna heal my Pokémon, too. So I'll be right back. I'm gonna go, um, and buy some more potions and whatnot, yeah. So I'm gonna buy, um... Both super potions and po yeah potions yeah so I'm gonna actually show it I guess because I we only I'm only at 17 minutes of recording time so yeah so let's see here buy let's buy um six potions I guess that should be enough I guess for now let me see um dang I meant to go to my item and shoot potions nine okay yeah super potions up like seven super potions from Lavender Town or something hopefully there's I think they sell them at Lavender Town. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to Tabasco. Jeez, there we go. I want to use Tabasco and use Fly. So yeah, let's fly back to what Flavin Town. We get to hear the Flavin Town music again. Awesome, which is pretty cool. There we go, let's buy some more Super Potion 7, I guess. So, uh, we have, uh, 9, 9, 9 Hyper Potions, 9 Super Potions, 9 Potions, and 1 Master Ball, of course, and so on. Yeah, and I forgot, to, I do not, if I, I'm pretty sure I didn't mention this, but, like, every town you, uh, go into, it's this, like, Palette Town is, like, a palette of, like, where you put all these colors on. Lavender Town is, like, Lavender is actually a color, which is purple, and it's, like, the same color as, uh, the name of the city. So, Saffron City has a saffron color, obviously. Uh, Pewter City has a pewter color, I guess, which is kind of, like, a blackish brown, I guess, color, dark color. So, I forgot to mention that every time, like, you go to a new city and whatnot. And stuff like that. I can't believe I didn't mention that before. It's kind of obvious though, too, but you know. Let's go back to Viridian City though. So, uh, I don't think I have to do any off, off screen training yet. Um, at least until we get. To, um, I might, my last time I'm probably going to do off screen training is right before the take on the lead floor, really. It's because, uh, everyone's pretty good on level. So, yeah, I know that, uh, in the next over while that's coming up and what that would do in the next part that he uh that Sean will start with a sand slash. So uh let's put Brute Root up front I guess. Yeah, okay cool. So yeah. So we're gonna make our way out there except for we're not gonna start the trial battle yet because that'd be starting a new thing and yeah. We're gonna do, we're gonna start in the next part, but I wanna actually get over, go over here and actually go over there, yeah. Nice, okay. So yeah. So yes, it's been around with Pokemon Yellow Walker to go part. Next part, we'll take on our rival battle for the second to last time, actually. Who who who? when will be the last time we battle him? You probably already know if you play the game, and if you know about the Kanto region and whatnot, but yeah. So yes, it's been Janko again. I would like to mention again goodbye, and I'll put you guys to explore my Pokemon Yellow Walkthrough Guide.